Hey, what's going on, y'all? So I got a couple more Milwaukee pack-out boxes. I've had a few of these for a while, like the organizers and some of the small organizers. Um, haven't used them just yet, but it's cool to have them. I might use them in the future. The drawer boxes are pretty sweet. That's the, I guess, latest, greatest thing I got the other day from Acme Tools when they were had a little bit of a discount. They don't have the three drawers. They're still out of stock. Um, and I picked up one of the XL toolboxes. It's a little bit smaller than the, or no, I think it's the exact same size as the rolling toolbox. It just doesn't have the wheels and the handle that sticks up and, you know, gets in the way of that tonneau cover. So if you're like me and um, you have a tonneau cover on your truck, it's just the half-ton Chevrolet 2002. Had it for quite a while, but got the Pace Edwards Jackrabbit, one of these rolling bed covers. Eighteen inches is pretty much your hard deck for the what fits and what doesn't. That regular organizer box fits on top of the drawer pack out box. And I, I think the three drawers are exactly the same height. Don't so you're, you're probably good there. But over here, when you stack two of these small guys on top of it, it kind of hits. You can make it fit. It'll go. It'll go just over it. But man, you're right. You're pushing it right there. That's about all that's going to fit underneath here. And then two of the crates will not fit if you stack those up underneath the bed cover anyway. Uh, that one just happened to squeeze in there. I was just kind of Tetris and stuff around to see what hits, what fits. Um, how I got mine in there is basically put that 2 by 6 in there to keep everything from sliding back so it keeps stuff like this towards the front. And then I can keep my spare tire and then that. And this right here has my normal just truck tools in there. A lot of it's spares that I don't use for HVAC and then regular kind of general purpose tools. But for all you Vito guys, this is a OTXL and it fits perfectly inside. If y'all need to keep your OTXL uh, waterproof, rainproof, casual theft proof, it fits perfectly inside the XL Milwaukee Packout box. And I even have a little bit of space in the front to put my stub gauges in a little pine pouch. So just FYI, it's a good, good utilization of that. But these things aren't completely waterproof, so it kind of keeps those tools from getting rusty or getting, you know, getting all those tools gross. So I don't get used all the time. So I like, I like to have them in there, but don't want them to get messed up. So anyway, like I said, I had that. So I kind of make this like a giant trunk with that bed cover is the idea. But uh, I like to keep it modular. So in the future, if I want to go kind of do side work, HVAC more. I can use those and they're right there. I can, you know, use that to work on, on the tailgate. But day to day, that's why I like having it modular. I just keep ice chest and then that job site toolbox has my mechanics tools. And that's generally what I carry with me because, you know, you got to change a tire or have some kind of roadside emergency when I'm out of town. I'll just take that along with me. Um, what else? Oh, I made this the other day. I was homesick with COVID, nothing to do. Felt better, but was still waiting to go back to work. I made my own dolly, just used two by fours and a base. Just made my own little dolly there. It works pretty darn good. Leveled out with a few washers so it doesn't weevil wobble. Pretty solid. Uh, the color matched pretty good and I'll show y'all what I had to do that. I just went to Walmart and got some strawberry fields uh, is the color code, I guess, or the color name. Rust-Oleum, just got a can of it from Walmart. But uh, yeah, it came out pretty good. You can see I got a pretty decent light on there. Damn near the same color of red as the Milwaukee red. So just in case anyone else is a Milwaukee guy, get Rust-Oleum Strawberry Fields. It matches pretty darn good. Uh, anyway, let's kind of keep it short, but that's what's up. I guess like and subscribe. Any other pack out video guys out there, that's kind of what hits and what fits if you're working out of a regular truck and not a van or something else. Um, Hadn't done any tool videos in a while. Pretty much still rocking the TP4B. That's my go-to bag. Um, man, the setup's the same. I love it. I got a OTXL, or the TPXL. I got the TPXL, but uh, didn't end up liking it, so stuck with the TP. That's all, all that's new on the tool bag front. So anyway, figure I'd throw a little content up there. Someone might find it useful. Y'all have a good one. Back to work next week.